Hi and hello everyone welcome to the Nursing Virus YouTube channel. Today I am going to teach you regarding how to make dopamine drug calculation with simple step by step process. Before going to the drug dose calculation we'll have short discussion regarding dopamine drug and what is need to be remembered by the nurse while preparing this drug. Do subscribe on Nursing Virus channel if you not yet done. And don't forget to click the bell icon and like button so you don't miss any videos. The generic name of this drug is dopamine hydrochloride. And the brand name is dopamine. The common drug dose availability is 200 mg in 5 ml ampoule or vial. And the other doses like 400 mg, 800 mg also used in clinical practices. The action is beta adrenergic agonist, this drug will mainly act as a vasopressor with inotropic effect. Vasoconstriction, such as increased blood pressure, semivascular resistance, cardiac output. On other side it's act as renal vasodilation when administering on low doses. The dopamine prescription is from 5 to 10 microgram per kilogram body weight per minute in initial dose. And it can be increased up to 20 to 50 microgram per kilogram body weight per minute. Warning of this drug is not for direct intravenous injection, must be diluted before use because it is potent drug. Route of administration is only intravenous. Three simple formulas or steps to calculate the dopamine drug dose and infusion rate. Step 1. The amount of the drug needed per 50 ml solution is equal to patient body weight in kg multiplied by 3. Step 2. Infusion preparation is equal to needed dose in milligram multiplied to available volume in ml divided by Available dose in milligram. Step 3. Rate of infusion per hour is equal to ordered or prescribed dose in microgram. Multiplied to body weight in kilogram. Multiplied to 60 minutes. This all divided by the drug concentration. Here the drug concentration can be calculated by following way. Needed dose in mg multiplied by 1000 microgram divided by diluted solution volume. Here remember that 1 milliliter is equal to 1000 microgram. Let's start with an example cases. Case number 1. A 60 years old male with diagnosis of myocardial infarction admitted in intensive care unit, the physician ordered. 10 microgram per kg body weight per minute of dopamine in 5% dextrose to the patient. As a nurse how will you calculate the infusion rate? The patient weight 50 kilograms. Step 1. Here are the three steps for calculating dopamine dose and infusion rate as follows. Already we know the formula for step 1. The amount of the drug needed per 50 ml solution is equal to here the patient body weight is 50 kilograms multiplied by 3 here we are getting 150 milligrams which is needed dose of dopamine for 50 milliliters dilution step 2 for the infusion preparation the needed dose is 150 milligrams multiplied to available volume of 5 milliliters dopamine is divided by available dose of 200 mg dopamine. Here we can simplify in 200, 450 and above in 150, 350s are there. So 3 multiplied to 5, this is equal to 15 divided by 4. So we will get 
3.75 ml of dopamine for dilution. Already we know that the dopamine should not given as direct dose, it should be always diluted and can be administered, for the dilution 46.25 ml of 5% dextrose. Add with 3.75 ml of dopamine. So total 50 ml as infusion preparation for administering to the patient. Before going to step 3. Need to calculate the drug concentration. The drug concentration can be calculated as Needed dose in 150 mg Multiplied to 1000 microgram Divided by Diluted volume Here we can simplify like this cross the 50 And in 150 Three fifties are there After doing this 3 multiplied with 1000 So the drug concentration is 3000 microgram Now the step 3. The rate of infusion per hour is equal to the ordered dose of dopamine is 10 microgram. Multiplied to the patient body weight 50 kilograms. Multiplied by 60 minutes. And it's all divided by the drug concentration. 3000 microgram. We can make the calculation some more easy. Make the big numbers as much as possible to simple numbers. So we can cross the possible numbers. And 10 milliliters per hour the dopamine can be infused with infusion pump to the case number 1. I hope on this video I made this calculation in detail and easy. If the video class is informative like and share and subscribe the channel, don't forget to click the bell icon below.